right. Okay, we'll record this. You know, guys and girls, welcome back. So I'm just hoping for the better this actually works. For some reason, I don't know, um, because there's no option for me when I'm recording in HDR. It looks like it could be overexposed with the the light when I'm recording. Let us know what you guys and girls on your th uh, side, um, whether it's to do with the screen or when I'm recording in HDR. I've got HDR mode on. Um, so I've got that down. SFX. Um, I got that. And uh, let's go into campaign a minute, just to quickly try and manage communities. We'll continue game. Manage communities. Why was that? Manage communities. Uh, now this is because this is the PC one, so I want to start a new um, skip to, yeah, skip tutorials, province, uh, standard. Anyway, um, this game is like a zombie game, so basically you go out, you have to it's a survival one. You have to try and survive away from these big massive like uh, zombie-like creatures. I think your team gets sort of like infected and then you have to go on the run and find other people. A bit like The Walking Dead in a way. Uh, this is in 3840-2160, 4K basically, 60 frames per second on the PC. But it depends if it runs at 60 frames or 4K. So we're going to have to have a look. Uh, choose your survivors or your new community. Okay, um, traits. Uh, piano teacher Lauren Josh. Uh, there's no pictures of him. Uh, it's, ah, here we go. Now we can. Uh, okay. So, because we've got this new disease at the moment uh, spreading, this new, not disease, but virus, what we'll do, we'll look at that one because she's got that little face mask on, so she'll suit right in. Um, so, we'll go and click on that. Oh, hang on. Uh, or maybe not, actually, where is that one? Just had uh, 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 face mask ones. I should we'll do we'll do some random ones. Oh, because that's some random characters. Takes a little bit of thing to load up. I've got this on my hard drive, on the main hard drive, not on the SSD. So, um, have a look. What's this one? Jim, Dave, and Ken <laughs> played. Was that? Uh, uh, let's have a look. Mm. Sabrina. Oh, he looks badass. Traits. Phoenix. Gerald McGregor. Um, 108. Love. 103. Run. Um, Heart. And all that. I oh, will try that. There we go. Uh, sure you want. Uh, is this community you want? Uh, yes. We'll start it here. <laughs> We're going to start the zombie apocalypse. Alright. Just a quick sort of tester to see how well this is, guys and girls. Um, actually, I got this for free on my Game Pass on the Xbox. So I can test out certain games on the PC. I, I, I don't really want to go back to the Xbox. Sort of. The, I got the Xbox One X. Um, and also I've got the PlayStation 4 and all that, but I don't want to go back to like con consoles when I've got a, like a beefy computer in a way that can handle most, I'd say most of the games, or if not all of them. But yeah, um, loading times though, um, what they should be doing, um, they should be getting the game pass very soon onto the new server. Um, so you can actually, uh, the cloud, I mean Xbox cloud, uh, or actually it's not even Xbox cloud either, is it? It's like, um, I think it's called X Cloud, which is basically in cooperation with Sony and Microsoft working together on it, which is actually, I think this is kind of a first for, um, Microsoft and PlayStation or like Sony to work together on it. Uh, which is that kind of interesting. 
but yeah, if you see some of the areas where it's really bright and sunny, you'll see and it's bright. over, like, sort of Again. contrast or so, saturated. Whose turn is it to find more fuel? Not me. Last time, a juggernaut almost ripped me in half. I have a better idea. We could settle down here instead of moving on. But if it's on the server, if it's on the server, it will actually take a lot off the, the CPU and people's computers. So it'd be good in a way because they'll have it on their servers. It does feel kinda homey. And they'll have it on an SSD so it'd be even 10 times faster. So once that comes out, I think they said it's going to come out any day now. We just have to find a spot that's um, then we can actually do it on Microsoft's um, and PlayStation sort of server to test out and see how fast they are. Because at the moment I'm using Google Stadia and that's actually amazing. The, the load times are really quick on it. I'm actually kind of impressed. Right, uh, we could sure use like a home or something. As you can see, it's like a little bit of laggy on the trees. Look with the uh, the shadows on the floor. You can see it's glitching a little bit, so. It is to do with the, the solid state drive as well, because I haven't got an SSD on it. Uh, not on this anyway, at least. I've got a USB solid state drive, but... Alright, can we get in here? Is anything working? Don't look like it's working. Uh, no. Okay, so we're going to have to walk it. As you can see, it's a little bit like sort of laggy, but let's see if this place can surprise. Seems us. to work. Uh, just approach the rear of the vehicle. Oh. Okay, let's try and do it. Let's see if we can take him from behind. Hang on. We have undead inbound. <laughs> oh. There's another one of those goddamn zombies. Oh, that wasn't bad. That's pretty good. This, oh, and what's, oh, <laughs> oh my god, he's just like resting in the uh, security clothes box thing. Um, I mean, obviously you can see the sky is like oversaturated. Once it starts recording, I'm recording in a like sort of HDR high dynamic. Oh, it's a creature, zombies. Are. I'm looking in here, so you can scavenge for different things. So if I click that, I see a little bit of glitching. Um, but once it's on the servers, once it's on the Microsoft uh, and PlayStation sort of servers, it should be good. I climb up the obstacles. Alright, let's have a look. We open up the bonnet. I can't um I'm here now. Let's get this done. Mm-hmm. Secure the Firewatch Fortress so you can claim it as your base. Right. <laughs> Oh, okay, so we've got to make a little base for ourselves. With a little patience and elbow grease, we might make a solid home. I guess we're good. Time to claim this place okay. and move in. Uh. That's just what I was thinking. Oh okay. god. Our first priority has to be gathering materials. We'll need them to improve Okay, this so we've got to gather some materials. Could you take a look around for it? Okay. Right, med stockpile depleted, ammo stockpile depleted, materials depleted, facility may break down. Okay. Forest for trees claimed a base in the province of Ridge. Alright, let's have a look. 
See ya. Mm, try and close that. <clears throat> Select an open slot to workshop or oh man, open slot to build a workshop or an open slot. Okay, so got to build a slot first. Don't get dead, okay? Okay. Um, so I should go over here. Okay. Cost five builds. Um. Manage. I also like stuff like collect. Use a s survey point such as the firewatch show to scout for location with materials. Ah, okay, up here. So I've got a scout for some materials where we can start building stuff. Alright. Uh, what the hell am I thinking? Almost out of those. Mm. Uh. Progress report. So far, so good. Got some okay. nearby locations. Oh, what's up here? Mm. Uh, mm. Ah, some little car stations. See here. Right, uh, we're going to use radio command to locate a source resources and get help from other survivors. Okay. Uh, I'm on. Yeah, that's not gonna work. Right guys and girls, um, let's quickly get to one of these buildings and see if we can find anything in you know. them. Try and get some resources. Right. Try and make this building into Fork Knox. Uh, oh, there's a nice place over here building here. Uh, scavenge a nearby site for ruck sack of materials.
Okay. Useful, I guess. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Screws, nails. Oh, I'm sad. I sir. Searching. Hold LB to search quickly. Use caution. You may end up making a lot of noise. So you can use the LB button to make Sweet. it faster. Central resources, containers, searched. Oh, that facility mod. That's a lot of stuff. Mm -hmm. But in here, I think in it. Nope. There. Yeah. Right. Uh, let's come and another nearby site. Probably. Mm, she has. A Facility over there. Actually, I wonder if there's something over this truck here. So it's a little bit laggy, but. Oh. Mm. Okay. But yeah, once uh, the Xbox. Uh, sort of cloud technology and PlayStation cloud technology kicks in when they work onto it. I think it's like X Cloud or something. Series X Cloud. Once that all begins I'll tell you what that's gonna revolutionise uh gaming entirely. Due to the fact that basically with gaming and stuff like you'll be able to game on the go Anywhere and everywhere. Uh. <laughs> it's, uh, potential resources in here. Alright, uh, I mean, it's pretty cool. Pretty good what they're doing nowadays with these sort of games. It's not though. safe here yet. So not secure. Okay, so. I need to try and get back to the base at the moment. Oh my god. That zombie right there, go on, go the other way. So I wonder if I can silently disperse the zombie. Come on, come on, come on, let's sneak up behind him. There we go. Right into the ground. Mmm, every piece of trash in town. You secure 25 sites by exploring every room. Uh, well, not every room, but at least the majority of it. Alright, um... So I need to get back to... The base living in uh what's that living in material world materials world scavenge a nearby site for rucksack uh oh there's a zombie over here I 
And I'll tell you what though guys, it goes once this technology comes in, right, say if you've got a beefy computer and it's does it really and it overheats a lot. I'll tell you what, forget about your like PCs overheating ever again because that won't happen as soon as your gaming technology I mean you'll be able to play on a really crappy lousy laptop and still get the benefits of uh, gaming go this way so you'll be able to buy say a 200 pound laptop set up Google Chrome or one of your websites with a decent sort of Ethernet category 7 or category 6 Ethernet cable straight into your computer or to the thing and then just play games like online and I mean if, if you've got a great internet you'll be able to stream games off the bat The future's looking great, the future's looking orange, well, technically not orange, but let's get in there. Um, okay, so let's empty this in here. Alright, so... Medical supplies, deposited three meds, um, six influences, uh, med stockpile low. And sometimes it can get really noisy as well with the fans, um, if you like sort of... playing games on high settings or ultra settings it's like at the moment I can hear my PC on and you can hear the fan kicking on the thing but then they'll be saying well what was the point of buying the graphics card high-end graphics card if you're gonna have a, a massive beefy graphics card on their servers I mean is it worth uh, buying a graphics card at the end well not really I suppose in a way Obviously, it's good to ooh, ooh, uh, it's good to have that option on the table. Oh, right in the head. Oh, oh. Go on. Go on, Deirdre. That's Deirdre there, the zombie. Let's give her a happy birthday. Oh, she's 93. Well, she was 93 years old, Deirdre. Now she's been gobbled up by the apocalypse, the zombie apocalypse. Says scavenger nearby site for rock saddle materials. So I've got to go over this way. I thought I've got to follow that red area. Seems a little bit glitching on the audio for some reason. I mean, obviously, you probably still get a lot of bugs and stuff, depending. It's, I mean, obviously, it's going to be down to the developers at the end of the day, the ones who actually develop the games on how they develop themselves. 
It's like I've heard something around about Doom's gonna be like, oh, oh. 1800p. Better make it stay oh. down. Oh. Uh. I can't keep this up. Oh. oh. Get off. Oh. Oh. Getting eaten by the zombies is not a good sign. Right, claim post. Ah, uh, slots available. Okay. Mm. I don't know who left this line around, but they're lost. Nowhere for that to go. Mm, uh. Search. Maybe they'll find someone even louder to eat. Oh. Oh, oh, oh. They got gobbled up, then. Nowhere for that to go. Let's have a look. Nowhere for that to go. Mm. Gotta be looking for something. Ah, rucksack. Look here. There's that building over there. Right. But yeah, uh, what, was it, what else can cloud technology do? Well, eventually. They'll be able to go into VR, but I mean, obviously they're going to need a low latency to do virtual reality and all that. The latency needs to be really, really low. Okay, look, make sure it's not lagging like that. But this is not running on cloud technology, this is just running off my computer at the moment. Oh, hang on. Ah. On the bloody wrong way. There we go. Now I should be a what's this ammo stock pole depleted med stock call uh stock pole low. Right, there we go. Establish material outpost at a site. Mm-hmm. So I wonder if I can I found some useful stuff while I was out scavenging. Mm. Okay. I should be able to get yeah. some signs. Maybe nothing. Oh. Uh, storage built in part of all resources upgradable. Eh? So basically, um. 
Can we search new territories? That's one pillar. Um, mm. I'm going to, and at what rates they're changing. Mm. Anyway, guys and girls, I'm going to save it here. If you enjoyed the episode, do like, favorite, share, comment, subscribe. It is the 17th, oh actually it's not the 17th now, it's actually the 18th of March. Now Wednesday, 18th of March at the time of the video. Um, actually technically it's still my birthday because was it uh, till 4 o'clock in the morning? Huh? 5 o'clock in the morning and then that's my birthday finished. Because uh, my mum said I was born at 5 o'clock in the morning. On the 17th. Yeah, so it didn't start yesterday, well, yesterday morning. Anyway, guys and girls, cheers for watching and stay safe all.